Hi, Nolte Manning II here, and welcome to another edition of Box Office Briefs, courtesy of the Shelby Star, shelbystar.com, and WGWG.org. And if you're listening to WGWG and radio, that's 88.3 FM. Also want to thank the Broadcast Film Critics Association, BFCA.org. And one more website I've got to throw out, a way that you can get in, in, involved in, uh, in being a part of this whole critics thing. You can become a critic yourself. Criticschoice.com. Now, the summer is officially over. Uh, this weekend marks the official beginning of, of, of the fall season. So next week we'll take a look ahead at what you can find out for the fall at the box office. But now let's look back at the movies that were for the summer of 2011. In at number five for the summer of 2011 with over $186 million, Cars 2. Uh, this movie got a solid B on the uh, Noel Manning report card. Pirates of the Caribbean on Stranger Tides. I tell you, I was actually really, really impressed with this part of the franchise film. I dug it. $239 million uh, at the summer box office and over a billion worldwide for this. Uh, I got this a solid A on my report card. Number three, uh, the only comedy in the mix, The Hangover Part 2, yet another sequel, $263 million. Uh, this one, you know, got to give only a C rating for this particular film. Transformers Dark of the Moon in at number two for the summer of 2011 with $349 million domestic. That's here in the U.S., over a billion dollars worldwide. And number one, for the summer of 2011, no surprise here, Harry Potter, the final chapter, the final installment, Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows Part 2, $371 million. I gave that movie a good, solid A. Same thing with uh, Transformers Dark of the Moon. Both of those films uh, well-deserving uh, to be in the top five as far as money's concerned, but also just uh, enjoyable films. It was a great summer at the box office and looking forward to uh, just an uh, enjoyable fall as well. Next week, we'll take a look at what you can expect this fall at the box office. Uh, for Box Office Briefs, for the Shelby Star, for WGWG, and the Broadcast Film Critics Association, Noel T. Manning II saying that is a wrap.